Fixcom surrogate has stopped working on Windows. Solution 1, Step 1, run the following commands as the admin user. Rakesver32 VB script.dll. Rakesver32 J script.dll. Step 2, check if the issue gets fixed. If not, boot into Windows safe mode. See more info at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash iwfb7y. If you do not encounter that error in safe mode, you put your computer in the clean boot state. Tip number one, putting your system in clean boot state helps in identifying if any third-party applications or startup items are causing the issue. If yes, you may go ahead and disable or remove the same using the recommended uninstall tool pro in this video guide. You may also check the hard drive for errors. Tip number two, to automatically repair problems with files and folders that the scan detects, select automatically fix file system errors. Otherwise, the disk check will report problems but not fix them. Tip number three, to perform a thorough check, select scan for and attempt recovery of bad sectors. This scan attempts to find and repair physical errors on the drive itself, and it can take much longer to complete. Tip number four, to check for both file errors and physical errors, select both automatically fix file system errors and scan for and attempt recovery of bad sectors. Warning, if any bad sectors are found while running the check disk utility and if attempt recovery of bad sectors is checked while checking the drive for errors, the data in the bad sector may be lost while attempting to recover bad sectors. Solution 2, Step 1 If you had any codec pack installed. If so, remove the program using the recommended uninstall tool pro in this video guide. Step 2, perform a clean boot and contact the program manufacturer for any updates and slash or, uninstall and reinstall the program. Note, after troubleshooting, put your computer to start as usual. Solution 3, if you met the error message while trying to print from the internet, try the below two steps. Step 1, enable turn on DEP for all programs and services except those I select. See related tutorial at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash eey6 fd. Step 2, locate c colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash dllhost.exe and save this change you made. Or, you may also try rolling back to the previous display driver, uninstall existing driver for the display editor. Solution 4, backup and delete the dlhost.
exe from c colon backslash windows backslash sysws64 folder refer to the below image solution 5 step 1 Check if you are using DIVX or Nero, try upgrading the software to the latest version. Note, you may need to uninstall and again install them in order make them work properly. If you've upgraded Nero and slash or DIVX and still face the error alert, you try renaming the below file at c colon backslash program files backslash common files backslash ahead backslash ds filter backslash any video dot x to any video dot x dot old. Please note, this action would break Nero Showtime, if you're using that app. Step 2, put your computer in a clean boot state. Step 3, as a workaround, you may turn off DEP data execution prevention for dlhost.exe. Tip, if you are on a 32-bit Windows, select the following file at c colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash dlhost.exe instead. Other voices, 1. Reset Windows Internet Explorer, if you met that error while running IE in your system. 2. Update Codex. See useful resource at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash tupjuf. Standard Codex 5.6.1 download, and slash or https colon slash slash goo.gl slash 6nm4xt. Vista Codec Package. 3. Disable Thumbnail. 4. Run the following two commands as the admin user. rexver 32 vb scriptdll rexver 32 jscriptdll 5. Install mcomview at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash hgmwdj.